Happening now, community leaders and store owners officially cut the ribbon for Uptown Greenville Superblock. WNCT's Brandon Goldner explains why leaders call the project a success story. Brandon. <laughs> Angela, we're standing in one of the Superblock's two new renovated buildings. Now, before this renovation took place, Uptown Director Bianca Showman tells me only one person was actually working in these buildings before the renovation. Since then, it's now 80 people and multiple businesses, multiple shops, multiple places. And these people can grab lunch and shop in Uptown, benefiting other businesses here. The city bank account also being helped. Superblock investor Don Edwards says the property tax value on this, these buildings Buildings actually tripled to more than a million dollars. Showman says this project has the ability to jumpstart more investments. People are inspired when they see construction taking place, and we've seen that the law of mutual attraction really does apply here. So when one good project happens, that does inspire new projects. The Superblock is part of $100 million in new investments to the area, and among those investments, as I reported a few weeks ago, include a multi-million dollar retail and apartment complex that will be built on Dickinson Avenue. Live in Uptown, Brandon Goldner, 9 on your side.